Welcome back to Skyrim, Choose Your Own Adventure, the story of Jace. And so, got Jace here, and um, yeah, he's wearing the Thieves Guild armor right now, and Crossus, the mask, yep, Thieves Guild armor, and uh, we've changed things up significantly. We've got a dwarven bow of thunderbolts made out of dwarves and thunderbolts and um, Dwarven Dagger and we've gotten rid of most of the rest of our weapons and um, yeah the game is significantly different than uh, it was during the last episode because I've had a bunch of problems with my system and with my mods so um, but I've managed I think to get something fairly stable so we've got Janassa again as a follower who's a dark elf and she's an archer I'm pretty good at sneaking and uh, one-handed and things and wearing heavy armor so she's probably one of the best followers I think um, and I decided that we'd just do um, a fairly short side quest tonight and um, that is to find the forge masters fingers and um, it's like way down just in the miscellaneous quests so yeah, find the Forge Master's fingers, and like we can't even get any information about it, but um, just to remind you... Behold the glory of the Forge Master's fingers! Um, this was a quest that was a task that was given to us by one of the orcs that we encountered. I don't know if the orc encampment... there it is. So right now there's only one orc encampment on our map, and um, it's because we're not allowed to interact with the orcs until we prove our worth essentially and um, Jace is kind of a sneaky um, illusion mage sort of character really doesn't have much need to interact with the orcs but um, since Jace is kind of an outcast character and the orcs are definitely outcasts in Skyrim I thought it might be might be fitting might be interesting but in any case um, once we get the Forge Master's fingers, the forging gloves, and return them to the orcs at Narzalbur, then um, we'll be able to see all the other orc strongholds on the map, and um, they'll be friends with us, and we'll be able to go trade with them, and things like that. And they're pretty good at making poisons, and um, and forging, so it should be should be useful. It's Janessa. Oh yeah, that's some good sneaking Janessa. Do you not even have a weapon? Oh no, you do. Okay, I gave, I gave her an elven sword. I gave her most of um, the good gear from Jace. And then, oh yeah, I haven't played this in a bit, so we should see what powers and things we have set up. Um, <laughs> I drank that Drain Magicka uh, potion uh, myself. And uh, <laughs> I don't know why it's so long lasting, um, but... Uh, yeah, I, I poisoned myself, and uh, let's see, we've got the Tower Stone right now is our special kind of like obelisk stone power. We saw the Warrior Stone when the game loaded in, and um, this one's kind of neat, just allows you to unlock um, a lock once a day without having to waste a bunch of lock picks. so I don't know, I think it's kind of good for a, a thief character like Jace, and um, we'll just see what... We might try to use throw voice here, although um, it's usually more fun to just... Lately I've just been using ice form. But if I remember correctly, this area has a bunch of mages in it. So I see someone off in the distance. Mm, caves. Wonder what's below. Yeah, so there, someone's actually... Oh, she saw us already. Nope. She didn't see us. <gasps> Interesting. 
melon nose. <laughs> nice. Ah! Sorry, Janessa. Janessa doesn't really need to be couraged. She has a lot of courage. Um, what is this? Snake came. <laughs> Alright. So. It's, uh, it's like, it's like Romeo and Juliet, so we'll take that one. Um, and that's kind of fun. Mud crabs. So, let's see if we can, see if we can cook something. Um, take advantage of this. <laughs> that's an excellently, excellently timed comment. Thanks, Janessa. We'll make these steamed mud crab legs. I didn't know I had butter. Oh, wow. Um, so what was over here? Oh, an iron ore vein. Okay, so where did she go? There you go. Um, so she looks like janassa has got, or is it me? One of us has ancient Nord arrows. Dragon's tongue, elven dagger. Yeah, this is kind of useless. Of roses, of dusk and dawn. But, um, we'll use our fine pickaxe. <laughs> uh, it's totally pointless, but, uh, I upgraded the pickaxe. Um, at one of the forging stations, <laughs> uh, well, well. as you can see, it is not just a pickaxe, but it is a fine pickaxe. What did I say I was going to do? Mine that ore? I guess I said that. Um, sometimes there's people in here, and um, we'll just try to calm them if there's anyone in here. Okay, so there's nobody in here. Um, so yeah, here's we could just use the tower unlock, but we'll just, it's only Apprentice, so we'll just do this. This really gets old, which is partly why I, um, unlocked the tower stone. Ooh, paralysis po poison, that's nice. Yeah, you can sleep on that hay pile. Um, Some of these nords will come up with any excuse to despise us. I mean, that's true. Alchemy Lab, I don't know if there's really any reason for this, but Damage Magica Regen is probably good. That's, re that's a really good potion. Um, Sorry. I don't care. <laughs> um, Damage Magica. kind of axe is that a person okay so we're, I think we're supposed to go down that way but we'll try to sneak up it's just like full look how light it is in here but but I'm sneaking oh I see the problem all right so what we want to do is do this instead. This guy's pretty powerful, actually. Um, the whites. Can I get a shot in? The whites can um, use dragon shouts, but so what we want to do is do that for Janessa and then um, we'll go back to the bow. Ah, 
right in the nads. All right, that went really well. Good job, Janessa. You kick butt. Um, I was previously um, running around with Lydia, who's kind of one of the first followers you can get in the game. And um, she's the house Jarl. And uh, she's the house Jarl for our house Carl. She's the house Carl for Whiterun. And um, yeah, she's just kind of uniformly terrible. But all right, so we took care of that guy. And do we need to go that way? Or do we go this way? Well, all right, we'll go over here. What's that? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> there we go. Hello! Are there some tribbles or s snakeys or something? All right. So, so far, there's like one geese. The very bones of the earth. The bones. Alright, well, Grand Soul Gems. We were supposed to collect Grand Soul Gems for someone. That's pretty nice. Hey. Hey, Janessa. Hi, Lydia! There we go. Hug. Hello! Yay! Okay, listen. Yes, Saram? Uh, I would like you... Yeah, so, Saram means wish. sir in uh, the dark elvish language. So this is kind of interesting. That, okay, so we want to be Jace, and we want to trade her these. And then we'll see if she put them on. Um, she did. Because they're better. So She's not wearing these boots, though. That's interesting. What boots do you have Let's on? Let's go. Oh, just your leather ones? All right. So... This is... I don't remember this at all. We'll get some apples. Um, are we even going the right way? Oh, we are. Okay, so... Well, maybe. We could have gone that other way. But oftentimes, you know, these just loop back around on each other, so it kind of doesn't matter, which is also a little bit sad in a way. Like, I would actually prefer it if you could... What the hell? I would actually prefer it if you could go the wrong way and, like, get stuck. I don't know what level these guys are, but we'll try to, um... We'll try to fury this dude and see if we can get him to all kill each other. And uh, since it's likely that it won't work, that um. Uh, oh, that's a cool spell. Um, I was gonna say we can do a potion of magic resistance if I can actually find it. Potion of magic. Magic. I know I made one. What the magic? Instead, and then what we want to do is we want to get his um, ability to regenerate magic down as much as possible. So. <laughs> so he can totally just cheat and 
just get potions. But I don't know why my Fus Roda didn't work. Sorry, Janessa. Alright, can we fear this guy? Right, you get the heck out of here. Um. I don't know if Janassa died, but this is this fight is not going the way that I wanted. Um, necromancer boots. Um, all right, we want to try to encourage Janassa if we can, and we are gonna need damage magicka region, and then um, resist magic, resist frost, and then we'll do a stamina potion. Uh, we'll do some of the potions that we made. Detonate dead. Oh my god. Um, that seems pretty good. Scroll of the Apocalypse. Um, oh, that's too bad. Scroll of Allian. If combat is not ended. <laughs> oh, Castor dies horribly. Uh, all that seems pretty good. 30 seconds of pull into mana range, take 10 damage per second. Targets on fire take extra damage. Alright, that seems pretty good. Um, dread zombie. We might want, like, one of these dudes. There we go. You. Alright. And then we're gonna, gonna cast one of these. Alright, let's go. Wait, did you kill the other ones? Get out of the way! Oh no, I set everybody on fire. Sorry, Janessa. There you go. Oh, she's on fire again. Um, okay, so what we really want to do is... Oh no, that's oil. Why didn't it catch on fire? Alright, well anyways, we survived somehow. This is so badly done. <laughs> uh, okay, so there's spike traps here. You okay? So I can hear someone attacking something. Oh, are they above us? They must be above us. So, um, no. Well, where, where the heck are they? All right. Um, out of practice of uh, sort of playing and talking at the same time I've been playing a lot of other games instead of this one because my game's just been so horribly broken for so long and I, and I thought that I'd have to give up the playthrough I was really concerned but it seems like it's been running kind of stably anyway um, so yeah these pots I don't know probably this won't even work but usually these pots are um, intended to be traps so you can yeah shoot them down and oftentimes there'll be like oil somewhere that you can spill on the ground and so you can really um, hurt the enemies especially the undead um, really hate that so I can hear something shooting I don't know if you guys can hear that oh there's a tripwire is there a disarm only activate I thought there was disarm somehow. All right, what's gonna happen? He's probably gonna get hit. Nope. All right. You can still back it, bash into that. I'll show you. I can't stand up because I'm underneath it. All 
Alright. Oops. Duck down, what are you doing? Uh -oh. I am Lua Al Skaven. Uh -oh. Who are you to disrupt my work? Be gone, or I will add you to my army of the dead. Well, listen. Yeah, take that. There's a headshot. Listen, um, uh, we don't care about that stuff, right? Like, we're just trying to get the Forge Master's fingers. If you could. If you could direct us to the Forge Master's fingers, I mean, that would be great. Because that's the only reason why we're here. Like, we don't care about your work or really anything at all at this point. Like, like I, I thought that this would just be like a nice, short, easy side quest to do. Like, I didn't think, I didn't think it was going to be all of this. So did we just go totally the wrong way? Oh no, like, it'll work out. We'll just be able to go back that way, I think. Oh, some of this room we didn't investigate? So there's like a drugger that we didn't find somewhere. Oh, it's Martin. Hi, Martin. My cat Martin is here. I'll um, be right back after I feed him.